how does that change in adulthood? I mean, theoretically, you know, we're always learning. The brain is always wanting to learn about new information and make calls inferences and whatnot. So are there any things that children are better at doing than adults? And, and what are they not as good at doing? So there's a, a very helpful distinction that comes up in computer science between exploitation and exploration. And the idea is this. Suppose you're trying to solve some problem, right? Well, one thing you can do is you can kind of get a good enough solution so that you can actually go out and implement it and get the thing that you want. That's the exploitation kind of uh, attitude. Um, another thing you could do is you could just try a million different things and see whether any of them work or don't work, what the outcomes are going to be. And that's exploration. And it turns out that you can show mathematically that you can't get a system that will simultaneously uh, give you the best exploitation and the best exploration. But you just think about it intuitively. And again, th I think thinking about the difference between kids and adults is a good way of, a good way of describing this. Your three-year-old is going to be very good at learning new things, very bad at getting to his snowsuit on so that he can get to preschool in the morning. 